Hey, what's up, everybody? Curlin, Damon from Quick Labs. We are launching our second annual pitch competition. We have five amazing teams competing for top prizes. So those top prizes are uh, first place, $1,500 cash prize, second place, $1,000 cash prize, third place, $500 cash prize. Fourth place is People's Choice Award, meaning people like you can vote for who you think has the best and most uh, viable business idea and concept. And now we're hosting it in our brand new facility in the Factory 41 building where the home of Quick Labs resides. Hi, I'm Blair Sigardi. I'm the principal from Patino School of Entrepreneurship. Um, tonight we get to experience the Quick Labs pitch competition with our uh, top I believe five junior and senior teams. Uh, they are going to be pitching for investment um, up to $1,500. This is a really exciting event. They've been working um, all year, the juniors, and for two years, the seniors. Um, they have been preparing their pitches. This is going to give them some excellent feedback on where they are in developing their business and um, how viable their business ideas are, really. Hi, I'm Rosalind Patrick. I'm here with Hot Dog on a Stick. I'm actually the franchise owner here in town for the Central California area. I've been working for the company for 24 years and actually been a franchise owner for seven years. I'm here with my daughter who is going to be an entrepreneur like her mom. And we're just excited to be a part of this amazing event today. Hi, my name is Lucy G. Alvarado and I'm the president of 59 Days of Code. We have to support each other. Um, me as an adult, as an older generation, I want our future to grow and I want to give them the knowledge that I have had and the struggles that I've had to in this business as being an entrepreneur. So I would like them to have a little piece of knowledge that I didn't get to have. Hi, I'm Catherine Verducci of 1903 Public Relations. Uh, it was great to be a judge here at this year's pitch competition. I think it is so important that we support entrepreneurship in the Valley. There's so much innovation and good ideas coming out of this area, and especially for our young people to feel supported and be excited about starting businesses. So we really commend uh, Quick Labs for, for putting this together and for bringing us all out here tonight. owner of Tower Blends as well as Cell Pros here in the Central Valley. Had a great opportunity to judge the pitch competition for Quick Labs. Just have to say that um, young minds coming up with ideas, developing those ideas, and learning how to take their products, that's a passion of mine. And uh, seeing them develop such well thought out visions and concepts uh, really inspires me to know that the next generation are going to be motivated, they're going to have uh, the amazing resources in places like Quick Labs to be able to bring their vision to life. My name is Alyssa Webster and I'm representing Sons of Soap Co. Um, and I was a guest judge today at the competition. Um, and it was really cool to see, it was a really full circle moment because I graduated from this school. And just to see people so passionate and giving time to make the community better and to I don't know, just get out of their comfort zone is really inspiring. Hey there, Jensen Lang. Um, I'm representing Romeo Plus. We're a tech company, uh, streamlining plant planning, and I'm um, here today at this event. And uh, it's so important for you to get involved with entrepreneurship. Uh, the Valley needs um, things, uh, events like this in order to bring hope, bring innovation, and bring creativity in the Valley. And there's so much talent here that uh, these events will make that impact, will make dreams come true. So really happy to be here. Uh, the out and the impact is so enormous. And uh, as long as these students, they believe it, as long as we have the event, uh, things will come true in the Valley. So thank you so much for having us. And uh, the event was such a success and uh, looking forward for next year. Hello, my name is Ryan Arias. My name is Raul Lopez. My name is Alexis Robledo. And together we're at Las Unidas. 
And a little bit about Redes Unidas is we're a financial literacy education company for the Hispanic community. Um, right now we're starting in Fresno, California in our local community and we're hoping to expand with uh, a website and as well as an app that's in development. We hope to gain exposure, get ourselves out there. We know there's going to be a lot of people here and networking we have found to be key to the growth of our business. So uh, we're looking forward to all the people here as well as the, the potential of winning. You know, uh, money can really accelerate us further and so that'd be, it'd be nice to win but ultimately we're happy to be here. Hello, my name is Josh Felipe. I am the CEO. My name is Efren. I'm the CMO. I'm Edwin. I'm the CTO. I'm Benicia. I'm CFO. I'm Jacqueline. I'm the COO. And we are Fort Flesa. And so our company is we produce Latin inspired flavors of ice cream that has 60 grams of protein per pint. That way our customers don't have to sacrifice their favorite delicious frozen treats to meet their protein goals. Currently, we're excited here to be at Quick Labs today because it gives us the opportunity to meet many different people and network with different companies and other judges. And also gives us the opportunity at a chance to win $1,500 in prize money and to compete against our fellow competitors. And quickly, we just want to thank Quick Labs for being the awesome people that they are, for helping us mentor at our school, and for, for hosting this beautiful event. Thank you. My name is Lourdes Vallejo, I'm the CEO. I'm Tandra Juarez, I'm the Secretary. I'm Alexa, I'm the CMO. I'm Sister Chang, the CTO. My name is Valde Guzman, and I'm the CFO. So we're the team behind TerraCity. TerraCity is an app where users can upload pictures of trash-filled areas, and then other users can pick and choose and clean them up at their own convenience. And then we would uh, reward our users according to the quality and the quantity of their work. And we also give the users the opportunity to uh, forego their rewards and put it towards community service hours instead. We're excited because we get to get more feedback. We love just fixing our business. We love getting the constructive criticism to just improve and uh, uh, also, like we're reaching more people um, for our cause. The Flaming Culinary Blades, we're trying to create the X-Series Blade, which is a, a heated, sharp chef knife where the blade actually heats up, so it's easier to cut through frozen goods such as frozen meats and hard to cut foods too. We're working right now on uh, building our prototype, the X-Series Blade and we're also trying to get a patent done. I'm proud to be here because I, uh, I really enjoy Quick Labs. I, I enjoyed the internship that I had two years ago with Quick Labs and I, I really enjoy their company and I wanted to be a part of the competition, not just because we could win a prize, but because it's really a different experience than what most high schools are given, you know? My name is Chris Washington, the CTO of Taste of Tradition. Hi, I'm Nadi Viretta, the CEO of Taste of Tradition. I'm Enrique Cantor, and I'm the CFO of Taste of Tradition. And I'm Natalie Torres, the CMO of Taste of Tradition. So basically, Taste of Tradition is an app where you can actually upload your family recipes that have been with you for generations, while also showing the stories behind them to many different people who will see them. We're excited to be here to um, you know, share our idea to the world. We are all different cultures, so we wanted to bring that into our business idea. And we just want to share that with people and get more contacts and get into the bigger world of Fresno and maybe outside of Fresno. I think it's a great opportunity as, as young people to experience like pitching in front of these adults, you know, because normal high schools don't kind of do this and we get to get the experience of actually winning money to put towards our business to better it. Hello, my name is Sarah. I'm the CEO of Reverse Recipe. And Reverse Recipe is an app that will take your ingredients, scan them, and once it identifies the ingredients, it'll find recipes utilizing those ingredients, saving you time and your money. Um, so today we were here, we are here at Quick Labs and we we're able to participate in the pitch competition. And we actually participated last year. Unfortunately, we didn't win, but we were given the opportunity again this year. And I'm very excited, I'm very hopeful, and hopefully we get something out of it. But if not, even it was just a great opportunity to participate. grateful and excited to use this money to put towards our business and to 
elevate it more. Thank you and so much. We thank Quick Labs for even having us here. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you, Quick Labs. <laughs> this is you. Well, I think I can speak for the team and when, when I say we're all excited, we're extremely grateful for the opportunity that we have here at Quick Labs. Um, we're excited to move forward with this money and do big things for us, for, for Nexus Unidas. I want to thank everybody who's helped us along this journey, our family, our mentors, our, our staff from our, our school. We want to thank them immensely for the support that they gave us and the guidance that they've uh, supported us with. Okay, everybody, this is the People's Choice Award. Give me a drum roll, please. this group looked like they had the right pieces in place um, with mentors and collaborations. They had a product that was ready to go. Um, we were impressed by their visuals. And so for first place, Portuaza. At first, I feel like the the first react, like the first feelings we had was just being nervous, yeah. and now our blood is just very pumped right now. Mm -hmm. Now we can actually like we can we can we can keep going with this. We can proceed with the business and just continue going. Thankful for Quick Labs because they helped us in sophomore year. They prepared us for our junior year, so we're thankful for that and hosting this event for us. We're also thankful for the people that came out to come support us here at, at Quick Labs for Fortaleza and are rooting for us. And then also for our mentors, very, very fortunate to have our mentors. And to all our families as well who helped us along the way.